you too, you too. Good morning, good morning. What's happening with you? Time is approaching, baby. Time is approaching. Ready to get this party started. Got me some good rest. Slept real good. Um, gonna sip on this coffee and hit my corral. I think the temperature about, I don't know. I, I don't be, I really don't look at the weather, but I, if I was guessing, maybe about 29, mid 20, between 25 to 29 degrees, if I was guessing, this is chilly out here. But that's what I like, baby. So I'm gonna sip on this coffee here and I'm gonna hit the my corral. Um, he told us, uh, told us it's very important that you get there real early. Um, the race started at 7, it's 6 o'clock. It takes me about 15 minutes to get there. I usually want to get there between about 45 minutes before time anyway. If you've been watching my content, y'all already know this. I want to get there early so I can scratch and, you know, get my mind right. So, um, and they, they told us it's best that we get there early. Um, try to get there about 6.15, between 6.15 and 6.30. Um, they have some, they say they have some events, some kind of uh, little heated tents and stuff. And they have, you know, because th this is a big race. I told you this yesterday. If you've been watching my content, it's a big race. So um, they probably have all kind of, I don't do. I remember one, one race I went to, they had a, a concert before the race. Uh, Bruno Mars performed. That was real dope. But I, I don't know what they're going to have on this one. So uh, I see what I get there if they have anything, but they did say uh, it's very important that you get there early. So that's what I'm about to do, uh, ladies and gents. About to get this party started, baby. Let's get Philadelphia behind me. Let's go. And let's get it, you too. Let's get it. Ladies and gentlemen, moment as uh, my favorite part of the morning happens along with seeing all of you at the finish line it is when uh, you know we get a couple of words in from our pro racers and our elite runners as well 15 seconds we're going to give you a countdown group of runners yeah good good segue john we're joined by jared ward and jared was the third american male to finish in new york city a couple of short weeks ago he has his son paul with him here today so paul is a runner in his own right ran a 5k in new york city so i think uh paul is going to give you some points. social media handles of him running in the philadelphia marathon what was it 1981 42 years unbelievable the way the city comes alive philly baby and, and every year Let's we've go. seen, over the course of the last few years, pandemic notwithstanding, this has been the way that we train and the way that we race, and, and I think it's, it's helping a lot of us stay healthier and run more miles, and, and so it's, uh, it is changing, but it's fun to see, it's fun to come to a, one of the best cities in the world, Philadelphia, and see this marathon, and, and see all of you out here. Oh uh, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Mile one, twelve twenty. I need some power. Mile two, ten forty. You are a so
Round yeah. three, ten forty five. Mile four, ten twenty. Mile six, ten, twenty seven. Well, shout out to the supporters. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to the supporters. Baby, the city of brotherly love. Woo! Oh yeah, that's what I'm doing. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh huh. Mile eight, ten forty eight. Mile nine, ten thirty nine. Mile 10, 10.34. Mile 11, 10.47. Mile 12, 10.04. Mile 13, 9.44. Deets and Watson finish. Total time. Alright, you two. It's a wrap, baby. Philadelphia is taking care of Pennsylvania. It's taken care of, baby. Anybody tell you that they ran a half marathon, they don't show you no shit like this. Tell them to go back and finish the job because they ain't did a damn thing. Well, it's a little chilly out here. It's windy. And I'm wet. I'm finna go find me some hot chocolate. Let's see if I can change into some drier clothes. If I can't do that, I'm going home. Boy, this wind is so disrespectful. It's so disrespectful. And I'm wet, and I can't sit out here when it's wet like this, when I'm wet like this. But I'll get back with y'all in a little while. YouTube, it's time for me to eat. Let's check out Sabrina's Cafe. Let's go. On uh, YouTube, let me show you what I got. Got me some toast, and 
tofu scramble, and of course some pancakes. Let's see what this tofu scramble tastes like. Yeah. I can work with that. That, that did pretty good there, boy. I'll give it to y'all in a minute. All right, now let's try these pancakes. Let's try these pancakes out. Sugar free syrup. Sugar free syrup. Let's try these pancakes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, you two. Y'all took me a good nap. Boy, I feel good now. Took me a nap. Now I'm about to go see what this city has to offer. Other than some more cold ass weather. About to go see what the business is. I'm gonna go around these streets. And y'all family, y'all come along with me. I told you, I promise y'all, I'm gonna take y'all along with me. This is exactly what I'm gonna do. Let's go see what the business is out here in these streets. Get with y'all in a minute. I know I gotta get me something to eat. I'm hungry now. I done, I done slapped me an appetite. So I'm up now. I'll be with y'all in a minute. YouTube, look how this city look at night. Ain't that beautiful? Look at this shit, boy. Woo. It's not, it doesn't start getting dark out here now. And that's beautiful to me. All right, YouTube, let's try out this spot here. It's called Ed's. Buffalo wings and pizza. Let's go check this out. Let's see what it's here for. Let's go. All right, you two, let me show you what I got. Everybody that I told I was going to Philly, they say you gotta eat a Philly cheese steak. Well, if you know me, you know I plant baked vegan. So I found me a vegan spot. I mean, well, a vegan cheese steak. Let me see what this is here for. You say I gotta have a Philly cheese steak? Here it is. Look good. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm about to tear this down, baby. Mm. Hell, yeah. All right, YouTube, I'm going to check out the spot called Playmaker Sports Bar. A little sports bar. About to get me some antifreeze. If you don't know what antifreeze is, you about to find out in a minute. Hey YouTube, this is a nice little spot, man. That I came up on. I just Googled playmakers. I mean, what I Googled was um, a sports bar near me. And uh, I just feel like watching. I wasn't watching a game. Just chill out, man. Um, and it's a nice little spot. I'm gonna turn this phone around and let you check it out. Let's say you got a couple of pool tables. You watch the game. Got the bar. Nice little spot. Get back with y'all in a minute. For those that don't know what antifreeze is, it's just a double shot of Remy and some ginger ale. With no ice. Sip on something like this when it's cold outside. Or you can get some hot chocolate, hot tea, whatever. But yeah. All right, you two. Done did 13 miles. And that's it for me. Um, today was not, I didn't pee, I didn't do a, try to do a PR. It was more of a fun run to me, man. Um, I didn't try to break no records or any of that shit. Um, it was fun though. It was, it was, it was, it was very interesting. Anytime, in my opinion, if you're running a big race, if you don't start like at the front of the line, you being one of the first correct first couple of corrals, corrals is, you know, it's groups. If you be in the, like in the, the first couple of groups, if you don't be in the first couple of groups, there's no need to try to PR. I mean, because if you, and if you like in the back toward the back, it's more of a group that's just really just doing this just for fun. So what I wind up doing, and had a good time, to be honest with you, had a, had an awesome time, man. Um, 
shout out to the supporters, man. They they supporting the run, passing out the water and all that shit, man. They really they they really need they really need the recognition that that they should get, man, because it, it, it was cold as hell out there and they just standing out there rooting you on holding up signs. Some of them signs was interesting. It was just a real real good race, man. Good race. Um and uh I done knocked down number 12. Mississippi is next. Um, when I get home, well, I got one more day here tomorrow. I just, you know, see the city. I ain't going to do, I'm not going to do no running. I, I'm going to just rest as long as I could tomorrow when I'm going to rest. And um, just show y'all show y'all parts of the city that I haven't been in. Uh, most of that place, most of the area of Philadelphia if you watch this content, this video right here, you see most of the most of the big the biggest part of Philadelphia. You got like the sports area. I'll probably show y'all that tomorrow. That's um with the football team, the basketball team, and the baseball team where they play they play their games and shit like that. But um other than that, man, um that, that's it, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna lay down, get me some rest. I'm a, I got another one of these. They give me some, get hydrate real good. Give me some more water in me. Thank y'all for watching. Y'all like, comment, subscribe, share the video. I may see, aka Scooby, and I'm out. Y'all be easy.